In other news this evening, six Kentuckians are making the long journey home as we speak. This after spending almost two weeks searching for victims in the deadly Surfside condo collapse. The rescue workers are part of a team called Ohio Task Force One. LEX 18's Kristen Edwards looks back on their challenging and emotional experience. A hero's farewell as Ohio Task Force One leaves Surfside after nearly two weeks. Six Kentuckians, part of the crew, have a long trip home after a tough week searching for victims. Literally, the team started from the 12th floor and we dug all the way down to the basement through 12 layers of concrete. Um, so it, it's, it's been difficult. Lexington Fire Captain Ryan Hogston says it's not only been physically draining, but emotionally draining as well as they recovered bodies in the rubble. Even though this is what we signed up for, uh, sometimes it's still hard to see. You know, it's still some of the stuff that we had to see is, is hard to see. The team has had access to a support group, but they've also depended on each other for support. Just having those people to lean on who've been through shared experiences really just um, it helps. It really does. It helps. It's the only way that's the best way to say it is it helps. He says it also helps to know they brought closure to victims families as they prepare to see their own. Happy to see my family, see my kids. So I uh, see my, my friends at work and, and things like that. A welcoming feeling after an experience that was both challenging and humbling. Kristen Edwards. LEX 18 News.